Hi guys, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Today's video is going to be a what's on my iPhone. This is my phone right here. I did one of these videos last year when I first got the phone, but it's been a little bit, so I wanted to do an updated one. But before we get started, I want to thank Caseify for sponsoring this video. If you guys don't know about Caseify, they are a very great brand that sells phone cases. Not only are the cases super cute, but they're also very durable and very protective. There's a bunch of different designs that you can choose from. They're super, super stylish, and I just love how diverse all the cases are. I have four different phone cases from Caseify. This is the one on my phone right now. I think it's so sick. So sick. First of all, it has my name. Love that. <laughs> Some of the cases are customizable. As you guys can see, I put Nicole. I used this font. I thought it was super cool and super edgy. You can change the fonts. You can change like the color of the text and you can also change where the text on the phone is. And then the coolest part about this case is this feature. I think this is so satisfying and I could literally just watch it all day. The next one I got is this one. The base is a black marble, but I did customize this one. It's the same thing as the other one because I just really like this font. So yeah, this is the second one. This next one is a clear case, but this one is also super, super cool. It's kind of like if you stuck a plane ticket on your phone, but I customized this one to say Nicoleno as well as Los Angeles because that is where I'm from. And then this last one is also another clear case, but it's kind of like a package was sent to you. So it says like fragile and it kind of has like that mailing shipping sticker, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so these are the cases I have from Casefy. Again, there's a bunch of different designs that you can choose from. So make sure you go to casefy.com slash Nicoleno to get 20% off your favorite new phone case. Okay, now the fun part. So Casefy has tested their phone cases and they can survive over a 6.6 .6 feet drop. So I'm going to be putting that up to the test and dropping my phone. I admit I'm a little nervous, but Casefy has said all the phones have survived. So we are gonna drop this and hopefully it survives. All right, so I'm currently downstairs in my living room and I have this ledge right here that drops down to here. <laughs> I'm gonna drop my phone from there down to here. Here's my phone. I have no cracks on the screen and the case is in 100% condition. So let's drop this phone, okay? <laughs> One, two, three. Let's see how my phone is. It survived! <laughs> so as you guys can see, Casefy cases are not only cute, but they're very protective. Make sure you go to casefy.com slash Nicoleno to get 20% off a phone case, and you can also click the link down below. Thank you again, Casefy, and now let's get on to the rest of the video. Okay, I'm gonna scoot over so I can put my phone screen right here. Okay, I'm gonna start screen recording. This never really works on the first try because it always turns off, but we're gonna hope for the best. Okay, we're screen recording. So this is my phone. This is my lock screen. It's a picture of me and my friends. It just turned off. <laughs> so this is a picture of the Cinnamon Sisters. As you guys know, my best friends that I've known basically my whole life, Maddie and Zyla. We call each other the Cinnamon Sisters because Zyla, C, Nicole, N, and then Madison, M. So like CNM, cinnamon, okay, yeah. <laughs> and then if you open my phone, this is my home screen. These are my other best friends, but this is my phone, guys. Welcome to my phone. <laughs> First, starting on this page, I have all the apps that Apple provides. You know, everyone has them, you can't delete them. And then also I have a folder because there's just so many and I didn't want them to like fill up two pages. So I have a folder of those. And then the ones that are out are kind of the ones I use on a daily. So like phone, FaceTime, settings, clock, you get the gist. At the bottom, at the dock, I have this folder. <laughs> And it's basically the apps I use the most. First, we have Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I'm Nicole Leno. Go follow me. <laughs> I post a bunch of dance videos on there. Next, I have Snapchat. The reason I have 74 notifications is because I have streaks with a bunch of people and I don't open them like right away. So they kind of just pile up. I'm on Snapchat, honestly, way too much. My friends are always on Snapchat. And then I'm always on Snapchat, so we're just always Snapchatting, you know? But you can go add me and Nicole Leno. Next, we have YouTube. I love this app so much. If you guys aren't subscribed, make sure you're subscribed. Yeah, this is, this is my YouTube channel. <laughs> now I have Pinterest. I literally love looking on Pinterest. Um, it gives me inspiration for a lot of things like outfits, nails, and I also love looking at puppies. Now I have Spotify. I mean, I have a few playlists. I have Simpin. I listen to this playlist all the time. Not that I'm simping about anyone, but like all these songs are so good. And then I also have R&B. I also put this playlist together. 
love all of these songs. It's so much fun to vibe to. And now I have Netflix. I also spend a lot of time on there too. <laughs> and then Disney Plus. Disney Plus is awesome. And Jenny, shout out to you because you know why. <laughs> okay, and then the rest of my doc, I just have messages, camera, and photos. All right, sliding on to the apps that I put into folders. So disclaimer, I have a lot of apps. I just don't use most of them. So I'll just go through the folders and kind of just tell you what I use the most and stuff. First, we have social. Here are all the apps in my social folder. I definitely use TikTok a lot. Who doesn't? I also use YouTube Studio. It's a really good place to look at your analytics and it's just an easy way to check on your YouTube channel just on your phone. Messenger to talk to my family in the Philippines and that's basically it for social. Editing. Fonto and Over I actually use for my thumbnails. Visco, I'm not a total like Visco girl. Like, most of the photos I post are just natural. I don't even filter them. But if I do want to filter them, I'll just use a really like light filter. Here's an example. I love the filter AL3. It's literally my favorite one out of all of them in Visco. Here is the normal picture. And then here is the picture with the filter AL3. It's just really subtle and it's not too much. I don't really use anything else, honestly. Next we have school. I have a bunch of the Google app. Oh my god, I can't talk. I have a bunch of the Google apps like Drive, Docs, Slides, Classroom, Chrome. And then I have Power School to look at my grades. These are my grades right now. Oh my god, Quizlet. Love this app. It just helps a lot. And then over here, I have Dictionary and Photomath. Dictionary, I usually just ask Siri. Photomath sometimes, but it's usually only to check if I did the problem right. Next, we have Shopping. Amazon, definitely use that a lot. Starbucks, I use it today. Honestly, I don't really online shop on these apps. Like, I don't remember the last time I opened some of these. <laughs> Next we have games. Don't judge me, but these are all the games I have. <laughs> so like I said, I will see some apps. Just download them and never delete them even though I don't even use them. Oh my god. I don't... Mm. I really need to delete some. Oh my god, why do I have so many? <laughs> I wouldn't say I play games on a daily. Like, I don't. I definitely don't. I would much rather be on Netflix than playing a game. But, like, if I'm ever bored or if I'm on a plane and I don't have Wi-Fi. Now I have productivity. Honestly, some of these apps are kind of random and they don't even follow the category productivity. But I just didn't have a place for them. So I just stuck them in here. <laughs> First, we have Google Calendar. I kind of use this. Not really because I actually use the actual calendar. And then I have the Bible. I like reading some verses. Flickster, movie times and stuff like that. Characters, it's where I find all of these fun little things. And then Amazon Alexa. I do have an Alexa. Hey, Alexa. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Next, I have Flo. Um... Yeah, that's a that's a that's an app for girls. <laughs> CoStar. It's basically telling you things about yourself based on your zodiac signs. It's kind of confusing. My sun sign is Sagittarius. My ascendant sign is Cancer. Like I didn't even know these existed before CoSign, but it's fun to read these paragraphs. And most of the time, they're true. And then I have Prime Video and then Evite. Next we have Travel. Ways. I think everyone knows about Waze. It's just basically maps, but finds different routes and stuff that takes you to places faster. Then we have Life of the 60 to film a tracking app. I know a lot of people know what Life of the 60 is. Then I have JetBlue, Cebu Pacific, and Shangri-La. Next I have Dance. So if you guys do not know, some of the LA studios are Playground and the Millennium. You can use these apps to see the schedule and also pay for classes. So that's what I use them for. And then the last folder is Theme Park. So I have Knott's, Disneyland, and Universal. I actually have passes for Knott's and Universal and then I have tickets for Disneyland. Hit me up if you want to go. <laughs> so yeah, that is everything on my phone. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks again to Case 5 for sponsoring this video. Make sure to go to casefy.com slash Nicoleano to get 20% off of a phone case. Also, make sure you're subscribed and like this video. And as you guys know, my comments are disabled on all my videos, but if you go to my community tab, they aren't. So there will be a separate post just for this video and you can leave all your comments there. You can ask me questions. I'll try to answer them and also leave some video suggestions of stuff you guys want to see. I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so, so much. Bye!